today's our first full day in Ibiza. I just got ready. I've done some light makeup this morning. Um, we did actually arrive yesterday. We had a pretty chilled day no, yesterday. <laughs> okay. <laughs> we somewhat had a chilled day yesterday. This is our gorgeous hotel that we've checked into. When I've come with like Mansell Rach, I've stayed in Playa de Mbosa. But I don't know, I just thought this would be something a little bit different. It's something a little bit more romantic couple vibes that kind of thing this is actually dan's first time in ibiza as well we had our first half day yesterday we had a little walk had a little bit of an explore we pretty much stayed like where we're staying so we stayed like in the old town yesterday did some exploring did a lot of walking around yeah so dan hadn't brought any trousers for this trip and i've booked some really nice meals i've booked leo for friday night but yeah dan didn't bring any pants so we had to make a trip to zara um zara here by the way is 10 out of 10 i actually want to go back to the zara women's it was like separate shops which i'd never really seen before zara men was like i don't know down the road the zara women's was so nice they had really nice like linen dresses linen skirts um i saw one dress in particular that i think i might actually go back for because it looked so beautiful so yeah we had a bit of a hectic day yesterday. Did some shopping. We went for dinner in the evening. I found a little restaurant just down the road from us that we went to. And then we had a very early night because we only had about three hours sleep the night before. So yeah, it's now our first full day. I've just got ready. Guys, I'm honestly in love with this bikini. I'm gonna have to show you properly in a minute, but it's so cute. I've actually brought a lot of stuff from NAKD for this trip. Um, because I'm doing some work with them on Instagram and TikTok, which I'm really excited about. This video isn't sponsored. I'm not working with them on this video, but I am wearing a lot of NAKD on this holiday. Yeah, I really love this bikini. It's a really gorgeous, soft yellow color. I'll show you properly in a second. And I'm really loving this necklace right now from Misoma. Um, I think it's a tiger's eye crystal which i'm still not entirely sure what the like properties and benefits are i'm gonna have to google it but yeah we're gonna head out in a second i've booked destino for today um it's been a little bit cloudy whilst we've been here so i'm hoping it's gonna brighten up anyway this is the bikini it's just a really simple top i think you can kind of like tie this a couple of different ways i think i'm gonna do this white fox dress today um, which is like a really nice kind of like loose knitted dress. Also, I've got a new vlogging camera. I feel like I'm still adjusting to how this camera works because I used to have a Canon G7X and I've switched to Sony. Yeah, you'll have to let me know how you find the camera in this vlog because I am using a new camera for the first time. I think I'm gonna take this big beach bag. I don't actually know where this is from because this was actually very kindly gifted by Nobu when me and Mads went there last year. But it's such a nice size for a beach bag. I mean, you can get so many things like this online. So I think I'm gonna take this with a couple of bits in. This is so random, but I am obsessed with Fit Flop flip-flops and these are the only flip-flops that I found that really fit and are really comfortable. They have like a little bit of, I don't know, like a little bit of a wedge if you can see. They're a little bit padded. I just feel like the way their shape is really comfortable to walk in and really comfortable to wear. So I brought these for this trip in white and black. I literally got these on Amazon for like £20 and they last me so well. My black ones I've had since last year. I think for my fragrance today, I'm going to do Mason Francis Kirkjan. This is their Aquamedia Cologne Forte, if I'm pronouncing that right. Hopefully I am. This bottle is so gorgeous and they actually engraved my name on the back which was so cool they do this in selfages now and it's completely free of charge with any product that you buy from them and i really love this scent it's unisex as well which is really nice and it's very sort of like fresh and i don't know it smells it reminds me of like a mojito or something like it's very much a holiday fragrance <laughs> So we got prawn tempura sushi rolls. Is it nice? Yeah, it looks. I've had too many margaritas. <laughs> so Dan never gets drunk. I'm always drunk one, but even Dan is a little bit drunk, so I feel like we're both as well. I get it from the side. Take the 
these curls out. I'm still yet to do these heatless curls and actually feel like I've done a good job with them. So I'm really hoping they look okay today. I don't think I've done them dry before and I think that's maybe where I was going wrong because I think doing them with wet hair, it was just making my hair like way too curly. But I thought I'd give it a go because it would save me a job this morning if it does work out. And it's looking a little bit better so far. It's kind of harder now that my hair is shorter because it wasn't really wrapping around as much but to be fair I kind of just wanted like beach waves beach curls today so I don't mind if they look a little bit messier than usual and do you know what I would say that's actually a success I'm just gonna use a wide a wide tooth comb a wide comb tooth a wide tooth comb to brush them out a little bit oh my gosh i feel like they're actually perfect for what i wanted today because we're off to the beach today i'm very excited i feel like i didn't vlog much yesterday so sorry about that we got quite drunk at destino which was not planned but that's also what holiday is for um i had far too many frozen margaritas which was a lot of fun and then we somewhat suffered at dinner, which was a shame really, because I booked Zuma for dinner, which was a recommendation from Mads. And it was so nice. It was Japanese cuisine. Um, we had some sushi. We had a really delicious dessert. They did a really good um, cheesecake. But yeah, I didn't actually eat that much because I was feeling a little bit worse for wear. So anyway, we came home. We have rested and recuperated is that the phrase is that the right term i feel like it is and we go again today we're going to amante amante i'm not entirely sure how you pronounce it um but it looks really nice it's a little bit further out i think it's like a 30 to like a 35 minute ish taxi um but it looks really nice and it looks a little bit smaller a little bit more sort of romantic. That's what I've been trying to do is to book things that I feel like are kind of couple-y as well. I mean, I, I suppose you knew anything as a couple in Ibiza, but yeah, I was trying to find places that just felt a little bit more like romantic. Um, and Amante looks really pretty, so I'm very excited. I've done a little bit more makeup this morning because um, Mads also said it is very picturesque and it does look really beautiful. So I figured I'd get some of my content on that. I just put my necklace back on from Misoma. I'm really loving this one at the minute. And I'm gonna do the same hoops. Also guys, I had an absolute tragedy yesterday. I don't even know if I wanna tell this story because it was just so heartbreaking. Um, it's time of the month, unfortunately for me, which is so annoying. I feel like there's no worse time to get your period than on a beach holiday because it's like, I'm just so conscious about it. And especially since I've been on the coil, like my periods have been a lot heavier, especially towards like the start anyway. One of my bikinis got ruined yesterday, which has never happened to me before. We had such a lovely waitress at Destino yesterday, like bless her, she came and brought me two extra tampons because I was so stressed, like just being in a bikini. I mean, luckily I brought a spare one because otherwise I would have been absolutely screwed. But yeah, that was fun. Honestly, being a woman, it's difficult sometimes, let me tell you. Have I got my bikini out for the day? And this is a bit dangerous, given that I ruined a bikini yesterday and this one is literally white. But I like this one and I feel like it's gonna look really pretty today for where we're going. NAKD, I love this one. It's so comfortable. It's like a really soft towel material. I like the cup at the back. It's not like too, too much still covering things so annoying these front two bits now that i've cut them short again they just never seem to hold a curl i need to know how amber curls my hair with straighteners because honestly if anyone can curl their hair with straighteners that is like a serious skill to me because i've always wanted to be able to do it and i just can't like every time i try it just ends up looking so bad <laughs> Put a little 
robe on and some slippers and we're gonna get ready for the evening. We were gonna have a chilled evening tonight and just go to like a local restaurant but we came back from the beach a little bit earlier than expected. Kind of my fault, I mean it wasn't totally my fault but I just wasn't feeling very well so we ended up coming back a little bit sooner. So I thought we'd make this evening a little bit more exciting than just doing something local so I've booked Tatel. It's a restaurant in Ibiza that me and Rach initially first went to and oh my gosh I think we went like three times when we came together um, over my birthday a couple of years ago because we loved it so much there. Um, it's quite like vibey, there's music on, it gets quite like loud and lively in the evening. Sorry, I feel like this camera <laughs> is so zoomed in. Like this is the furthest I can hold it away and I still feel like it's really close to my face. I'm gonna have to get a different lens for it, but we're gonna make do it, it's fine. But yeah, it means that I can dress up a little bit more. I'm gonna wear heels. I've not entirely decided what I'm gonna wear yet. I'm actually really impressed at how well this has lasted. I've been doing my like everyday makeup a little bit different recently. Um, in like a bit of a different order to what I would usually do as well. Usually when I do just like quick everyday beach makeup, I won't do my under eye and I won't powder. But I did put a little bit of concealer and a little bit of powder on today. So I feel like it's really helps to just like make everything last. I'm worried I'm going to regret this because I have powdered, but I think I'm just going to add, oh, do I want to do it? No, I really don't like putting creams on top of powders. How, what, what time is it? I'm like um and ah, and if I'm going, if I want to make this risk, is it? A tiny bit. I just feel like it needs a dab. Anyway, yeah. So we went to Amanti today to the beach, which was so lovely. It was a lot more like laid back, relaxed. I was using Elf concealer. This is what concealer is this? The Hydrating Camo Concealer in the shade Fair Warm. It's probably the lightest concealer that I own, but it, I do really like it just for brightening the under eye. Oh my God, if anyone ever goes, I had, I can't remember what it was actually called, but it was like a garlic risotto with burrata in. Oh my gosh, it was probably the best risotto I've ever had. It was incredible. Yeah, honestly, the food was incredible. The whole menu was actually really, really nice. There was a lot of like salads that I really liked the look of as well. And yeah, I started feeling a little bit unwell. I feel like I felt a bit unwell this whole trip. So I'm sorry if like, I don't know, my energy has just seemed a bit low in this vlog. I've just not felt great. Still having a gorgeous time, still happy to be here. Still, yeah, very much looking forward to the rest of the trip. I just, I don't know, I just felt a bit flat. So I'm sorry if that has translated in this vlog. Hopefully it hasn't. Another product that I am obsessed with currently. This is the Makeup by Mario Soft Sculpt Transforming Skin Perfector in medium. It's like the more shimmery bronzer. Um, this is what I've got on my cheeks today mixed with like a shimmery blush. And it's just so nice for dusting over the skin just to add like a really nice amount of warmth. Thank you. It's like pure cream. <laughs> creamy, creamy match. Guys, how cute is this outfit? <clears throat> Excuse me, where's my voice just gone? The bralette is NAKD and then this little skirt is from Zara. I don't know, I just really like it. I feel like the colours go really well together. Anyway, good morning. We are about to go out for breakfast. Um, we're actually going to go down to Passion for breakfast this morning, which is just a short walk down into like the old town from where we're staying. We did actually go for lunch on the first day that we got here. Uh, we've not been for breakfast yet and I'm sure some of you guys know it's one of my favorite places to go for breakfast in Ibiza. Um, me, Mads, Rach have all been there together. It's like our favorite place to go. So yeah, we're gonna go and have some breakfast there. The breakfast here at the hotel has been nice but not a passion. <laughs> so I thought we'd go out today instead because we've not really got any plans in the day today. We were gonna go to a beach club, but we've got Leo booked this evening, which I'm so excited about. Um, so we're not gonna drink in the day. I don't know, I just didn't wanna go really far out. And when you go to a beach club in Ibiza, you always have a minimum spend. We're not drinking and not really eating that much, then we'd probably struggle to spend the money. 
Um, so I don't know, just felt a little bit pointless. So we're gonna have a little bit of a walk around, probably spend some time at the pool here because we do actually have a really nice pool upstairs. And then yeah, it just means that we're nice and close to the room to get ready for dinner tonight. Definitely gonna be dressing up tonight. I've got a dress already picked out that I'm so excited to wear. Dan thinks it looks like a nighty, but I literally love it, it's so cute. Yours is literally like the biggest stack of it smells so good. We have so many drinks on the go. I've just made a very much impulse purchase whilst exploring the hotel. We were trying to find like the second lobby space. This hotel is really interesting. It's across like lots of floors. Like there's lots of layers to it. Of buildings. Yeah, like to get out to the pool, it's like five flights of stairs across different bits i can't even explain it um but we found this really cute little like nook it's a really cute shower there which would be cute for a picky i'm thinking um and then up those stairs is the bar and the pool but we just sat here for a minute because it's in the shade um and yeah we were trying to find like the second lobby space and they had like i think it was a pop-up store but they had loads of really cute sunglasses as soon as i saw the sunglasses stand i knew i was doomed for so well dan's actually treated me to a pair of sunglasses that i saw i saw these really cute ysl um kind of like black frame slightly like cat shaped sunglasses which i've actually been on the hunt for for ages not those specifically but just some like winged sunglasses because all i really have at the minute is my chanel ones that i wear um and i tried them on and i literally fell in love and the sales assistant was so nice I honestly feel like that makes such a difference when you have a really nice sales assistant um, because I can't lie, when we've been shopping here recently, a lot of the sales staff have been really rude, but she was so sweet. So I got myself some sunglasses, I'll show you them later. I've had to put my hair up in a little bond because it's really, really hot and I've also stole Dan's shirt. So love that for me. But yeah, I think I might go and sit up at the bar and get a drink. Suddenly running a little bit late to dinner so I thought I'd just quickly show you my outfit before we go because I have to say I think this is my favourite outfit of the trip so far. Okay so this is the dress, ignore the room, it looks like an absolute bombsite because we really just had to rush getting ready um, but this is from NAKD, it's this really gorgeous silk, it's almost a maxi, it's not quite to the floor um, but yeah I've gone with this and my new heels and I've done sleep pony full glam because we're going to Leo. But yeah, I'm so excited. I'm trying to get there a little bit early as well, just so that we've got time to have a wander before we sit down. Um, but yeah, I'm so excited. And this is makeup and outfit of the night. for wear this morning definitely enjoyed ourselves last night we've tried to make an effort to get up early this morning this is our last full day which i cannot believe how quickly this trip has gone we've had like five days but it's i don't know it's just gone so quickly um and i've saved what i am hoping and what i feel like will be the best day to last um, so I've actually booked as a boat day today. It's the same company that I booked through when me and Rach came over my birthday. Um, I've booked the same boat. I tried to book the same captain because we had a captain last time called Lolo and he was so lovely. He was just like incredible the whole day. Um, but he's actually booked on like a bigger boat. So we've got a new captain today. But yeah, I'm really excited. I've booked it through Smart Charter Ibiza. They are incredible so helpful we were actually supposed to come on this trip last september um but we got freddie around august time and because he was a puppy at the time we didn't want to leave him so we ended up moving this whole ibiza trip to this year so it's kind of felt like a bonus holiday which has been really nice because a lot of it was already paid for last year and they were super helpful because i did actually pay the deposit for the boat last year and i was worrying that i wasn't going to be able to move it but they were so good about it um yeah they just they moved it for us with no charge at all so yeah I'm very much looking forward to it I feel like I, I said this last night I probably shouldn't have booked Leo and a boat day back to back because yeah 
feeling a little bit worse for wear this morning, but it's gonna be fine. It's gonna be a really nice chill day. I've just put on a little beach cover up from NAKD. Let me show you in the mirror. So yeah, this is my outfit for the day. Mm -hmm. 